Well, there is no deal. Hundreds of Tufts Medical Center nurses walking off the job. The first nurses strike in Boston in more than 30 years. WBZ's Julie McDonald is live on the story tonight. Julie, this all seems to be about pay and about benefits. Well, David, a lot of it is about competitive wages. Take a look behind me at this strike now in its 13th hour. The nurses say the competitive wages would benefit their staff and it would benefit patients because it would help them to retain new, young, bright nurses that they spend months training but often lose to other hospitals. We care. We heal. More than 12 hours after hundreds of Tufts nurses left their assignments and formed a picket line, their voices are still loud and clear. Don't let them break that promise. This walkout comes after months of failed negotiations. Nurses fighting for competitive pay, better staffing, and to preserve their pensions. Hospital leaders say they tried. We made significant movement. We extended the pension for an additional 18 months. And we put $2.5 million back on the table. Nurses, though, insisting this isn't about money, but better quality care for the patients who need them. We have very sick cancer patients that we're leaving inside, and it's heartbreaking. It's really hard for us to be out here and to leave them inside. We want a better deal. Hundreds of replacement nurses have been flown in from all around the country. And even when this 24 hour strike concludes, those fill ins will stay on until Monday. You know, if you're going to lock out their staff, then to me, they don't really care about their patients. Because if I was a patient here, I'd want a nurse that was here taking care of me, who knows the system, knows the routine. And you can hear some of the many cars that have driven by today and been beeping, showing their support with these nurses. Now, all of these nurses felt very strongly about returning to their patients tomorrow, but hospital leaders tell us that in order to get all of those replacement nurses to come here, they had to guarantee them a five-day contract. Stay with WBZ. We'll bring you more from here, the picket line, over on WBZ at 11. Live in Boston, Julie McDonald, WBZ News.